Hey guys, welcome back to Brainters. So in today's video, we will be talking about DC, the important concepts जो आपको DC में करने हैं in order to pass this particular exam. Also the questions that will help you kick start your preparation. And आपको अगर ज़्यादा like questions चाहिए, IMPs चाहिए, question bank चाहिए, तो वो आपको कहाँ पे मिलेंगे? ये सब हम later part of the video में discuss करेंगे. Talking about the IMP questions जो हमने आपके लिए निकाल के रखे हैं, those are fourteen important questions जो आपको सबसे पहले करने हैं when it comes to DC. So let's get started with it. We will be learning them in like four sections. Section one, section two will be very important. So let's get started with section one, wherein the first question is short note on first is RPC and RMI. Second is Hadoop distribution file system. Third is systolic architecture. So these are the three short notes of question number one. Make करने talking about question number two. You'll be doing discuss the need for process migration and the role of resource to process and process to resource binding in process migration. So this is the question number two. Question number three is describe any one method of logical clock synchronization. So guys, these three you'll be doing for section one. Let's go to section two. Where in the first is. Brief the different load estimation policies and process transfer policies used by load balancing algorithms. Next is discuss the structural and data hazards in pipeline architecture. Discuss any one control or mitigate of them in detail. Next is justify how Rickert Agarwal's algorithm optimized the message overhead in achieving mutual ex exclusion. Next particular question is what is the different architectural model of the distribution system? Write with uh, like explain this with a neat diagram. And the last one for this particular section is what are various issues of distributed systems? So guys, these are the most important eight questions जो आपको करने हैं in order for a kick start or like important जो आपको DC में पहले करने हैं. That doesn't mean you don't check out the section three, section four. So if you're wondering कि इसके answers and everything कहाँ पे they are already available in the Brain Eaters app. So make sure you check it. You can download the app now for more information. Talking about the questions that you need to do in section three. So the first question is. Suppose through experimentation, it was verified that seventy percent of the execution was spent on parallelizable uh, execution. What is the maximum speed up and efficiency those can be achieved with eight processors? Next is give example of the following message communication model. First is transit synchronous. Synchronous. Second is response based synchronous communication. Third is transient asynchronous. Fourth is persistent asynchronous. Fifth is receipt based communication. So guys, you need to put on examples for these. Next question is design and analyze three stage pipeline operations executing the following task x of n plus y of n into z of n for n equal to one comma two comma three up till seven. So these three questions you will be doing for section three. Let's go to section four. Where in the first is clearly explain how monotonic read consistency model is different from read. Uh, your right read or write consistency model. Support your answer with suitable example or application scenarios where each of them can be distinctly used. Next question is apply quick sort parallel algorithm for the following example: sixteen, eight, thirty-three, forty-five, twenty-five, nineteen, fifty-three, six. And the last particular question is differentiate between distributed OS, network OS, and middleware OS. So guys, these are the most important fourteen questions जो आपको DC में करने हैं in order to get a kick start for your preparation or else passing mark questions. So if you're wondering कि आपको ज़्यादा question कहाँ से मिलेंगे या कैसे करोगे, so we have already uploaded all the questions in the Brain Eaters plans. उसमें आपको तीन plan मिल जाएंगे, ठीक है? Depending on whatever your aim is to score, आप passing marks के question कर सकते हो, आप average marks के questions कर सकते हो, and आप scoring के लिए भी questions कर सकते हो. इन सब के आंसर्स ऑलरेडी अवेलेबल है बी एच नोट में वंस यू डन विद बी एच प्लान गो टू दी एच क्वेश्चन बैंक आपको मॉड्यूल वाइज क्वेश्चन मिल जाएंगे उसमें सो चैप्टर वन में से कितने करने हैं चैप्टर टू में से कितने करने हैं चैप्टर थ्री में से करने एक प्रॉपर काउंट अवेलेबल है वहां पे सो गैस चेक दैट एज वेल सो अगर मैं आपको समरी दू अगर आपने कुछ भी नहीं पढ़ा है जस्ट गो टू द ब्रीनिटोज ऐप पहले प्लान करो फिर क्वेश्चन बैंक करो यू आर गुड टू गो फॉर द एग्जाम ओके सो यू नीड नॉट वरी वी हैव लाइक कवर्ड ईच एंड एवरी कॉन्सेप्ट जो आपको करना है इसमें एंड अगर आप एग्जाम के एक रात पहले भी लाइक इफ यू आर प्लानिंग टू फिनिश एवरी थिंग अप इट इज प्रैक्टिकली पॉसिबल क्योंकि आपको ज्यादा क्वेश्चन नहीं करना है यू जस्ट हैव टू लाइक स्मार्टली कवर ईच एंड एवरी कॉन्सेप्ट दैट यू हैव मैंशनड 
so i hope this solves your doubt for how to pass or score before like uh, ending up this video i would like to tell you agar aapko koi bhi reference book ki zarurat ho ya aise koi doubt ho ya uh, materials chahiye ho you can join our whatsapp community our team is active 24/7 aapko drive links uh, fir answers क्वेश्चन बैंक्स वाइवा क्वेश्चन एवरीथिंग आपको मिल जाएगा व्हाट्सएप कम्युनिटी में फॉर मोर अनाउंसमेंट्स एंड अपडेट्स आप प्रेट और इंस्टाग्राम भी फॉलो कर सकते हो जॉब अपडेट्स होते हैं एकेडमिक अपडेट्स होते हैं टाइमलाइंस होते हैं टाइम टेबल्स होते हैं एवरी अपडेट इज पोस्टेड ऑन इंस्टाग्राम सो यू कैन लाइक फॉलो अस देयर एज वेल यू कैन स्टे कनेक्टेड टू अस ऑन लिंकड इन ऑल्सो इफ यू आर लुकिंग फॉर एनी जॉब और यू आर लुकिंग फॉर एनी नॉन टेक्निकल इंटर्नशिप our career page is definitely open for you all i'm putting the link in the bio you can check that up you can apply and our team will get back to you okay so i guess this is it for this particular video or aapko agar koi aur video chahiye ya koi aur doubt hai koi aur subject ka video chahiye please comment down and i will try to make sure ki aapko sare how to pass questions mil jaye and aap easily figure kar sako ye subject ko kaise clear karna hai even if it is one night prior okay So yeah I guess that's it for today's video and I'll see you in the next one bye bye